Hello, dear viewer, and welcome back to Doncaster, the mobile deck building RPG. I was basically getting through some health stuff, so uh, without further ado, I am thinking maybe we try to power level the hunter, since it seems to be the easiest one to power level, shall we say. So let's try this, and wait, can I change difficulty? I guess we'll do that after we select our character. Uh, did I unlock a new portrait? I guess I did. Okay, so we can take the hatchet or the battle axe. Hmm. We can try to go for a bleeding thing, but hatchets were just so good and simple. Let's take the hatchets for now. Serrated weapon. That would work well with the battle axe. But we can start with anger. Ooh. Slay. Reset this cooldown. What? Okay, wait, 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 so we reset a cooldown on the weapon or on the talent or on the, ha, huh. <laughs> all right, but Carl, yes, I saw your comment, and this seemed like a good one to bring an encore back for while I was trying to figure stuff out. Hmm, exterminate seems really good with our hatchet build as well, but yeah, let's try, I don't know, impossible mode? <laughs> Let's, let's see if that gives us more XP or not. It might not. Maybe... Yeah, you only get half XP? No, I think I think we go impossible. We'll, we'll try it. Hmm. We can randomize the maps. Interesting. Okay, seated run. No, let's try randomizing. See how that goes. All cards? Yeah, okay. We'll try this with Amaranth. Charlotte Slinger. All right. Ooh, and I will try to go quickly, as fast as my weeping woods will allow, I suppose. The Gilded Summons, yes, yes, we've seen you before. We've talked to our pal before, but we're gonna just get our 15 money and leave our pal there. We're gonna take opportunities whenever we see them, pretty much. Uh, we can remove a card, yeah. Oh, I only have three hats, huh? What is it? Okay, so let's check. What else, anything else change? Hmm, I wonder why it only offered me three hatchets. Weird. We could do the shrine first, and I think that makes sense. Hmm. I can add a surge card. Let's take a surge of dexterity, I think. Yes. Shouldn't matter. The question is, do I want the extra basic attack or the extra health? Hmm, we might need the health more in the future, but I'll do this. I'll do this. Two opportunities down, no. Okay, so this one we know. Finding shelter is just, yeah, better. Wait, I have a shield, okay. Cool. All right then. Oh, you can get rid of your shield card. I never noticed that. Apparently Carl was saying we can reroll our talents as we get them in the future, so I might keep an eye out for that. This corrupted test score I want to try to take out now to get rid of its aura for the future. Oh, I still have 70 health. That's my theory. We're sticking with it for now. Hatch it off. Hatch it off. And then I think we go with one more hatchet and a block. It'll be important to note how much damage this thing does impossible. Ah! It does many damage. Okay. <laughs> or at least six. Hmm. Okay. So we're gonna do hatchet, surge of strength, you should be good now, hmm, okay, so exterminate adds damage to the next attack, got it, I thought it would affect the exterminate card itself, but it affects the next card after exterminate, okay, so that makes sense mechanically speaking. I have also taken far too much damage already. Glorious. Wonderful. Everything we've ever wanted. Just hatchets, eh? Oh my goodness. Apparently I should have activated my weapon power. Yep, yep. Okay. Well, uh, my worst nightmare. Remembering my weapon power. We'll do that. Alright then, so. We made it. We lived. 
reaping. Hmm, deal five damage, gain souls. I don't even care about souls. Deal four damage, take one damage, but it's free. Hmm. There's a soul reap is four damage and costs one. We have charges, we have souls. Eh, I think we take wild strike. Bad for our health. But so are all these monsters, so you know what? Here we go. Let's... Hmm. Upgrade a basic attack. So one of our upgrades... Not now. We'll be working. Let's go for the Stinger Spider. So we're gonna try to make sure to keep an eye out for the upgraded hatchet. There it is. Yoink. How dare you. Okay, we do that. Then that. I can Wild Strike for free. Let's see if the shield blocks it. It does not. Okay. Did I take two damage from that Wild Strike instead of just one? But why, though? But why, though? Hmm. We do want to actually get exterminated off earlier. So then we can get that to work. Okay. And I'm very close to death. I probably should have warmed my hands to fire. Because, oh my goodness. The damage. Okay. Well, we have a bunch of hands. Means we don't have to do wild strike, but yeah, it looks like the bleeding damage is way worse in Impossible. Who, who would have expected? Wow. <laughs> uh, we're going to go with none of these. Opportunity for sure. Hmm. Okay, take the coins. Get the money. There's a bird. Hello, bird. If that is the word. Uh, hmm. Let's do hatchet, hatchet, block, wild strike. Okay. Alright. I do have bleeding. Let's check bleeding in impossible. Hmm. Yeah. It's interesting, it's acting like a poison as well, though? Hmm. Let's do a little bit of this. A little bit of that. None of my hatchets look any better than the others. This, then you evade. Will you evade my exterminate? No. You're going to evade one of these hatchet strikes, and then the other one hits. Oh, and it cancels out the evade bonus? Man. Okay, I think we just need to rush this. My goodness. So this is where one big hit would have been better, but oh well. That is not what we built for. Hmm. Impossible mode. I guess you really have to pick your battles a lot better in impossible mode, which, you know, makes sense. Okay. Oh, well, we took significant damage. We're not dead yet. Hmm. Oh, we have life drain on reaper. So let's Maybe take that. That might keep us alive enough. Traveler, take me to safety. Who are you, Julius? Beat him back. Okay. Hmm. So everything is bad for me. Let's try a sharp claw. Maybe it'll work out. But probably not. Let's be real. That hit. The others will not. Okay, and I don't have any better axes. Okay. I am hoping we can get through this without dying. And then... Well, I guess we'll find out. Hmm. There's our better hatchet. Hatchet. So no, okay, why? Hmm. I'm not taking damage now. I guess I didn't have Wild Strike before when I was taking that damage, right? Hmm. Well, we heal five. So we'll probably survive this, but eh. Yeah, okay, bleeding seems to be functioning as previously. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I don't know. Let's get some more of this. Block before I forget. Hmm. Wild Strike doesn't have flanking. It's good damage. I don't think you're evading right now, right? No. Okay, now you evade. And Val! Okay. So we're making it almost to our next level. Deal 4 damage, ambush, conjure, and items seems pretty important to us. 
If we can get a healing potion, that could change our life. If we don't, well, we're dead. And I got my weapon talent again. Okay. Hmm. Wait, wait. We do this first. The love potion. You know what? Sure, bud. Sure. We'll do that. Get some dexterity, and as much as I would like to use Wild Strike, I don't think I can afford it right now. So we'll do that. Okay, be enchanted by me. Yes, no, I'm dead. Okay. How much XP do we get, though? Daily bonus XP. Yeah, okay. Only 141. Hmm. We will try again. This time with a battle axe. Serrated weapon. Try to go with the bleed, maybe. Let's not do impossible. Let's do... Hmm. Hmm. Let's try challenging. We have fewer campfires. They have increased health and everything. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Let's try it. See if this goes well or not. If we make over 141 XP, that's better than what we just did in terms of investment. Of time and energy and all that. Okay. Cards. Give them to me. No? Coins. We'll take coins. Hello, Shop Fowler. Okay, you have less health than you did in Impossible. That makes this more possible. Battle Axe. Bonk. Okay, and then we are sad. Alright, we're well, uh, Yeah, yeah, that, that looks right. Looks right. Okay. That looks very similar to what we saw previously. Yes. Down. We can put to bleeding. Seems good. Uh, evade. That makes sense. Maybe I should've just waited. Hmm. I don't think the evade goes away until we do attack again, but I should double check. Okay, well, we're doing this. And that. Well, it looks like our battle axe ability doesn't go away. Okay. Last rate is a bunch of bleeding. That seems pretty good. Getting a bunch of energy is very good with our battle axes, then. Yeah. Okay. We do this. Then we take one opportunity, leave the other one to rot, which stinks. Okay. Uh, we can warm our hands by the fire, not too important. We're going to get a random card instead. Do that. And take. Sharpshooter. Worthless at the moment. How oh, wonderful. Okay, another opportunity before they're all gone. Ooh. Okay, another opportunity. Path is blocked by a tree. Hello, massive boy. You are a bore to me. Hmm. We don't need Surge of Dexterity unless we want another attack. Do we care? I don't think we care. Discard you. Get some bleeding in there. And some shielding. Okay, and then we'll see what lies before us. Okay, well, fewer attacks, which is nice. Hmm, do I care about sharpshooter? No. It's an enchantment, and it is a plague upon us. All right, then. I need to get rid of it sooner rather than later. Shield before I forget. Okay, I guess I could have ended it there if I didn't shield, but... It pro okay, it did bite me. Literally. Hmm. Okay, battle axe. There we go. Hmm. Pocket aces. Huh. That could be fun. We can gain regenerate and anger. Also pretty decent. Hmm. We can inflict poison. Convert all poison to bleeding. That seems interesting. We'll try it. It's probably stupid, but we're going to try. Remove a card, battle axe, or is a battle axe worse than sharpshooter? No. All right. Hmm. Stinger Spider has less health. We will try to do or die. Hmm. Sort of strength. 
should have ambushed with you. So let's go ahead and just set this up for the future with a bunch of energy. And we'll do that and prepare. Here's a pencil. It was a pointed disappointment. Hmm. Okay, you have thorns or gouge. Battle axe. And block. Okay. Hmm. Okay. So they have bleeding. So we'll deal ten damage. So that's pretty good. Okay. So now we have some decent ways of getting the bleeding in there. It seems pretty good. Uh, hmm. The Sharpening Stone might be worth... Ah, Trancor. Thundering Mighty Hammer thing. We've never seen what this actually does. Deal three damage twice, gain chain equal to the damage dealt. Chain. This is not the build for Trancor. If anything, it might be the build for Flourishing Bow because of the finale, right? Finale, we can play with two or fewer cards remaining in hand. Ah, okay. No. So we'll take the Sharpening Stone because it goes away eventually. Okay. And then we can get rid of another card. Bad lax. Hmm. Opportunity, maybe. Maybe you will help me to eat the berries. Bad lax removed. Okay. Hello, Julius. Goodbye, Julius. And then shrine. It's time to shine. Transform a bad lax. Healing Potion seems pretty good here. Uh, three piercing damage and one bleeding when your foe plays an action. Persistent. Hmm. That means we can inflict bleeding whenever we have the best thing for our buck. Interesting. I don't have too much healing though. Uh, we'll, we'll take count those. Might be useful on the boss. Okay. Then the Raven. Now it has the Aura. Hmm. So let's search his strength. Caltrops to figure out. Okay. Doing that. Is it still in the deck? It looks like it might still be in the deck. So we do that. Okay, and then our next battle axe we use should be upgraded twice. Okay. Uh huh. So we want to inflict bleeding before the battle axe. We want to inflict poison, which is nice. So I think we do this. Get rid of one of our battle axes. Then we can count battle axe. Yeah, and then it's plus two. Okay. So that's actually plus four if we can activate it. Because crits are double damage. Hmm. Battle mending is interesting, it's an action. Huh. But curse strike, make a basic attack and inflict a random affliction. That could work out for us getting random bleed or poison or whatever, so we'll try it. We'll try it and hopefully not die to it. Okay. We still have 60 health, which is much better than our impossible run. <laughs> hmm. Mild skewer seems important to do now. Go ahead and do that. We don't have the bleed yet, so let's do cow traps and block. Hmm. So we've got Curse Strike, we've got Sword of Strength, a Druid. I think I actually get rid of my block here, which is probably crazy. I'm going to try. Okay. You have bleeding though. What? Okay, well. Alright. Hmm. Did not do as much as I'd hoped. Right, you're supposed to... 
culprit when there's bleeding. Now the enemy isn't bleeding. We can change that. And then that should be 14. Yeah. And two from bleed. Okay. Well, all right then. Maybe we only get one critical hit per turn? Hmm. Okay, soul bolt. Huh. I don't think we take any of these, but soul bolt's interesting. And flexible. But we have no way to gain souls, really. So, yeah, no. Not right now. Take on another raven. I will try to inflict bleeding on the boss when we see the boss, so I'm not going to use it now. That. Hmm. And then I think we'll try to get. Wait, are you? Are you? Doing... Okay. Okay, right. I was looking at the wrong bleeding last time. I think. Okay, that happened. Hmm. Yeah, you are still bleeding, man. So our battle axe should hit for a lot. That's a five, that's a five, okay. Yep, and then you dodge. Hmm. So I think we just block twice. Okay. Yep. Swoopy swoop. Okay, there goes the poison. Let's see. This should work. Yeah, okay. Oh, all right, I could have gotten one more health, but we'll take it. Okay, so we can re-roll. I mean, return a card from your hand to your discard pile. Hmm. Okay. Start of combat, shuffle three snares. That might be good, depending on the snare. Remind me. Oh. Well, okay. That happened. Um, hmm. We can make Plague Strike work with our other thing. Hmm. Require, remind me, a snare, one piercing damage. I was hoping it was bleeding. I couldn't remember off the top of my head. Nope. Hmm. Do we play go strike? I think we do not, because we're trying to bleed more, and it's kind of random if we get any poison. Let's take on the bandit. Probably Because you attack immediately. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, we'll get it out of the way. Okay, we've got our Vile Skewer. And do I... I think I just do this. Alright. Okay. And it almost threw all their poison already, which is one reason I wasn't terribly interested in some of the other stuff. Do that. And get rid of our battle axe, because it's not super helpful at the moment. Gouge and caltrops. Okay. Hmm. So far, so good. So. I am now poisoned, it looks like. Okay. Hmm. Let's heal a little bit. Get that working. We can just battle axe and only end up taking no damage. Never mind. Okay. I have to decrease the damage that was incoming. So we can convert all poison into bleeding. So this. Hmm. Could have been good. Could have been good. Gaining evasion, though, might be really important. So let's get Sanguine Step. Alright, let's take out the precursor to the boss, finally. Mm hmm. Lobbing poison, I see. Very well. All right, then. We can do a couple different things. So I could keep the battle axe around, but I think we just get rid of it. And block. There we go. All right, then. Am I still dazed? I am. Hmm. Unfortunate. Uh, you're bleeding, though. So, goodbye. Okay, battle axes are good if you have enough energy and bleeding. <laughs> hmm, I don't think I need another of those. 
Hmm, let's see if strike is interesting because it's just good damage if you keep using it. Uh, let's go for the wolf. See if we can't get another good bleed card or something crazy. Uh, we'll do this first. Sort of strength. Get rid of our battle axe for now. Prepare for when we have the better battle axe. some evasion, right? Hmm. hmm. Yes. So, that's annoying. Um, let's do this. That. Bottle axe. And block. Okay. Does it... Yeah, it KO'd itself. Oh, and it looks like... They're nice enough that if they KO themselves by playing a card, you don't take the damage. Intriguing. We can add more snares and evasion with Come Give Me. I think we do that. All right, now we click the button. We attack the boss. There we go. Now you have bleed, so Battle Axe is better immediately. We can do that, though. Get some more snares. You are already bleeding. I think I want to add more bleed, though. We'll do that. And we'll wait for the better battle axe. Okay, some spider broodlings, you know, you know how it is. Hmm. Okay. I can only play four cards. So let's do this first. Then that. Then this. Good damage. We take damage. Okay. I also take some damage here. Hmm. Okay. Probably gonna get spidered a lot here. But the snares are doing some good work. Wow. Well, okay then. Hmm. Now... I think we do some more of this. Adrenaline Caltrops. Get rid of Caltrops for the energy. And then we can, yeah, do stuff like this. Uh, inflict bleeding is very important versus a random thing. Yeah, we'll do that for free as well. Now we can't play the last one. We'll see how this goes. If we get some snares as well as the poison effect. Oh, no, no. Okay. Alright. But the snares are piling up, which is pretty interesting. We can do that. I guess I should have just battle that. Oh well. Oh uh, well. Hmm. Add a snare to the foe's deck and flip one jinxed if your foe has three more snares. That actually seems good. Okay. Considering we have so much snare stuff. I don't think there's anything else left, so we go to Bright Candle. Mm -mm -mm. More brightness in the darkness. Okay then, console. Give me my money. Eventually. Not right. Um, Alchemist. Do you have what I desire? Upgrade a card, transmute a card. We could upgrade our good battle axe. That's not bad. I think we just make our one good battle axe even better. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. The only question is do I keep my other battle axe? And I don't know. I don't know. Let's. Because we could upgrade both of them. But I think we're trying to go for removing the worst one. So we can kind of get our snare, poison, bleed stuff going better. And then the end. Let's heal. Okay. Now we leave. On we will go. To adventure! Yeah. Okay, so I was thinking I would probably die again by now, but uh, I have not. So let's continue a little bit further. Just a little bit further. Opportunity knocks. 
let's heal a bit and not get the Lord of Mercy mad at us. It seems like a good plan. Uh, find shelter yet again. Raise the shield. Or wait at the stone. Uh, let's raise the shield. Okay. There goes another shield. Mm, do I need to get rid of anything else? Honestly, it looks like we're doing pretty decent. We cut out a lot of the chaff. I want to keep one block around for now, so let's go for the Bloodhound before I can upgrade anybody else with that aura. Get rid of the aura from the battlefield. Got third strength. I don't think I even need adrenaline right now, but I might use it. And I played to the wrong side. Okay, uh, we'll just wait. We'll just wait. Great. Oh, what splendid tacticianry. Okay. We can do this immediately. Uh, hush is pure green. Let's do that. Hmm. Evasion seems pretty good. Do that for the bleeding. And I'll go ahead and curse her. Okay. So unfortunately I didn't get to use my super battle axe, but that's okay. That seems to have worked pretty well with our snares. Okay, we play this first. And then we can figure out what we want to do next. I mean, evasion seems like a good plan. Hmm. Let's add some more bleeding. Make sure that sticks around. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Hmm. Hush, I do want to play. Yeah, I don't think you have ambush. Well, that's good. You do 16? Yes, okay. Then we can do that. Okay. Good enough. And then hopefully the snares will get you. Yes, okay. Wonderful. Oh, very, very Hmm. Oh, Cut All Ties is interesting, but it feels like we have too many green-only cards already. Hmm. Conjure a random melee action and make its cost zero. It could be good. But I don't really want to take damage, so we're going to ignore that. Okay. Shrine time. Memorize a card. So we always get it early. Hush is good. That seems like a good plan, maybe. Okay, we'll try that. And maybe that is a terrible decision. I guess we'll find out the hard way. Hmm. Ah. It may have been a terrible decision. <laughs> you do better when you're ambushed. Okay, so I should have am memorized Come Get Me. Yep. Hmm. Well, this hurts. But I think we do this. We can hush. Come Get Me. Cursed Strike. And you have... Stagger. Stagger counts as an affliction? Huh. Because they do take damage. Interesting. Okay. Hmm. Vile Skewer. Skewer Caltrops and the Bioblocks. Even though they weren't bleeding, we didn't get the critical hit. I think the damage is still worth it. Ooh, we're lucky that was a low roll. Okay. Hmm. Come get me. Seems pretty useful. Then, hmm. Sanguine step seems like a good plan. I do that for some bleeding, and we'll do that for more. Okay. So hopefully, when we get our good battle axe again, it will deal 16 this time. Okay. Hmm. 
Hush doesn't need to go first, right? No. Cursed strike? No. Okay. So let's do this, get rid of our block. And now we have some options. Let's go with our best option first. Then you. Then that. Okay, and then they might die to snares plus other stuff. Right? No? Nope. Okay, just steal damage. Fine. Be that way. Mm. Hush is just good, but we don't have to do that first. So we'll do this. I don't think we need cow traps at the moment. Let's do hush. Play red whenever we can. And hope that they die through the snares. Yep. Should. Excellent. Okay then. Victory. Hmm. Could get the life drain. Inflict four bleeding just seems good for us, so we'll take a lacerate. Alright. Um, Shrine. How are you? Hand the statue a coin or a card? Let's go with a coin. So we gain an extra coin. Because I don't think I want to replicate. I could replicate my good battle axe. Hmm. Oh well. This. Examine the stone. What in the world? The blacksmith grumbles, scratching the back of his head. That's no ordinary ox. I haven't seen metal that could cleave granite in a long, long time. Shame to leave it like that. It is a work of art. Perhaps there are more of these weapons to be found elsewhere. Okay. Interesting. I don't remember what we can get out of that in the future. Hmm. Your next step is agree with a precarious splosh as you feel your foot sinking into a strange puddle. Try to free yourself. You scramble to find anything to grab hold of as you feel the puddle closing around your waist. Finally, your fingers find purchase and you manage to pull yourself free. But not without considerable damage to some of the cards in your deck. No! Wait. Hmm. Hmm. Can I get rid of Lassery? Or damage? Gouge is nice because we deal initial damage, but we don't necessarily need it. Like, last ray is better bleed. Hmm. Yeah, I think we remove gouge over bleed. Yeah, over last ray. Very similar words. Okay. Well, dear viewer, I think we'll call it a day here. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you've been enjoying Dawncaster. And I hope you have a great day, dear viewer.